we're here to, to show you how to clean the black tank out in a 2016 21 foot Freelander Class C motorhome. So first of all, we're gonna get the hose out and go from there. Right here is our sewage hose. See? Go around over here with this over here. So, down below here is our valve. They call these gate valves. Undo the cap. Hold in. Just like so. You always clean the black tank out first because that's where all the stuff is. First one, just like that. Now we're also, this is what they call the black tank flush. This will clean intake, clean the inside of the potty tank, paper and all that kind of stuff that gets kind of around the edges and all that. This, this is the newest way, much easier way to clean your potty tank. And what happens with that is there, these little arms pop down. They have little octopus arms around there as it, it will spin around and clean, like I said, all the paper and stuff off the side of the black tank. Very good thing to do to keep your tank very sano and clean and you don't get those, you know, after, after smells and this and that in there. So it's very, very important to do that. Also right here, we have got down here, you would go ahead and pull this valve, which is your gray tank. So you do the black tank first, and then you do the gray one. The gray one's soap and water, and that will clean out the potty holes and, you know, kind of so you don't wrap it up and put the thing full of stuff. Okay, now I just shut this black valve one time. I'm gonna let that go for a few minutes, just to get a good cleaning in that thing. And if you'd like, you could always do a clear fitting right here, so you can see when the clear water starts coming through and you've got all the you know, the other brown water or whatnot. When you see it nice and clean, you know you have a nice, clean black tank. It's very, very important to keep these clean just so you have a sano clean. You don't get, like I said, these, the smells coming up into the RV and making your evening miserable or food not tasting so good. But anyways, we'll go ahead and shut this guy off now. And once again, pull the gate valve. And we're done. Make sure your valves are all shut back in. So when you take this off, done.